everybody, and welcome back to Arcage. Uh, last episode we did the Warborn starter and uh, character creation. Uh, this time I thought we'd take a look at the Dwarf. These are the two new races, so oh, let us have a look, shall we? What's he doing? Uh, can't see me being a man on that. Oh, a little bit of a jig as she lands. As I said before, this is quite a change from the dwarves I know of. Alright, let's have a look. Let's see what we can do with her. Select the skill set. Oh, hang on. I do the. Uh... Do I have to do this before? We said that was difficult, didn't we? I think we did. I oh, like the outfit though. Let's have a look at this, shall we? It's only going to be for the starter area anyway, so let's have a look. What have we got there? Antithesis. Okay. Skewers, okay, that's an AOE. And that increases the attack speed. Let's, let's have a look. What harm can it do? <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, uh, so we'll do the different bodies. Oh, there isn't any choices in the body size intensity. Giving us a choice of uh, body size or anything. It's very strange in an MMO. Uh, right, okay, here. Uh, let's have a look at that, shall we? Let's have a look at the. Okay, I like that straight away. I like that. <laughs> Oh, we'll, we'll, we'll have a look quickly through these options. That's pretty. Oh, that's pretty snazzy. So you do get quite a few options on the hairstyles. I'm thinking though I like the first one. I like that one. Eyes. Where do we do eye colour? Eye colour, where do we get that? No, we don't want like that, do we? Um, no, come on, where do we get the eye colour from? First details. Am I missing something? Pupil size, eye size, head, iris, that'll be it, won't it? There we go. Um, I think the iris is alright on there. What's that one? I prefer that, I think. Uh, much. Okay. Um, style. Paint. No, we don't want any of that. Lips. They look fine to me. Let's actually have a smile. Oh, God, that's scary. Uh, that's very sad. That'll do. <laughs> um, oh, God, here we go. Name changes. Names, what can we do? Uh, she's a dwarf, isn't she? Uh, let's do. Uh, let's do Dorfless. There we go, Dorfless. I'm sure nobody's got that. There we go. 
Okay, that's not the outfit that we wanted, but that'll do. And start game. Let's see what this brings. Eventually. Alright, loading screen. Okay. I must say I do like that music at the start of the uh, doing the character creation screen. It's quite nice. I've not checked yet to see if I got a hit from yesterday for posting the uh, the Warborn video. I must check that if I remember. Which is highly unlikely knowing me. And while this is loading, don't forget folks, if you like the videos, leave me a like and subscribe. It would be very helpful. I also have a Patreon as well account, which you can click on the main screen. And that nearly wasted enough time to get it up. There we go. <laughs> Any time today would be fine. Seriously, any time today. Thank you. You awoke outside in the brisk air of a mountain plateau, a strange voice ringing in your ears. You had no idea where you were or even who you were. Besides a headache, your mind was as blank as an uncarved rock. <laughs> oh, so we're not going to get a special area? Are we not? Oh, okay. That's very... Snazzy little run. It's very perky. Very nice. And she does actually look like the character's, the character's creation screen. Yeah, very good. I would have liked it if they give us a few more options of body-wise, rather than having the same body on every one of them. But, these things happen. Uh, I'm going to investigate the massive surge of magical energy. I want to find as a groggy dwarf with no memory. What have you been up to? I wonder. Uh, questions will have to wait. It looks like the glider pilot needs your help. Okay. When you accept a glider, yes, okay. Yes. The Fallen Glider, report to Lady Inga. 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 Is that this? Energizer. Oh yeah, a little speed boost, very nice. Mm. Oh, we have mobs. Still looks very good, uh, Arcade, I must admit. I like the way she runs at speed, that's very good. Hello. Hello, doppelganger body and hair. Oh my god. <laughs> it's me with different coloured hair. Okay, accept. Yeah, la da 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 da. Collect energizing tea leaves. Okay. In the middle of some forest hedgehogs. What have we got here attack wise? Holy bolt. Inflicts plus thirty seven percent damage on cursed targets. How do we curse it? Heals allies blessed by you as long as they're within fifty meters of the target. Okay, so it's a combo. What's this? Signpost. And we get a quest. Oh, few achievements. What's this? No achievement completed. Ambitions. None. Okay. Here. Corpses that sparkle can be looted for items and coins. F okay. Up all items while G lets you pick and choose. Some leaf green man. What the hell is that? 
Let's get this. Oh, he's going to... Yes, he spotted me. Did I get out of the way in time? Yes. One more hedgehog. Alright, I need the tea leaves. Alright, you're going to be in the way, so we'll have to get you. you to go away so I can collect. Thank you very much. Four or five. Oh, and this one to respond. That's very nice of it. Five or five completed. Talk to Mikhail Inga. Lady Inga's favour. She's up this hill. Got a speed boost. And away we go. I don't recognise this starting area, so it maybe is a, a completely new one for the uh, the dwarf. Hello. I really wish to put some voice acting in this as well. Make things more interesting. Instead of reading all this. Earned a skill point. Open skills. Uh, what have we got? Holy bolt, we have that. Mirror light. Effect granted, but I can't just <laughs> I can't look at it. Uh caster allies cures one debuff and increases received healing by fifteen percent. 1 minute 30 enemies inflict snare. Okay, right, so it's a dual purpose. Oh, hang on a minute. Helps if I uh, get it first, doesn't it? There we go. There it is. New skill set unlocks at level five. All right, hello, Mr. Dorf. I accept that. Thank you very much. Collect fine pollen from honeybees west. I take it they're going to be. Oh, what's this? A potato. Do we need potatoes? Visit the mysterious machine west of Summer Leaf Camp. Okay, that's up the road. A bit further along. We have another kill quest here by the look of it. Is it Energizer? An on fire Energizer. Oh, of course, we have to fight honeybees in order to get the honey. Is that correct? Yes, pollen. Kill moss slimes and poisonous crested lizards. Okay, well, let's throw these here, so let's kill these. Should have snared it, shouldn't I? There we go. Nice. Need to use what skills you've got, Nick. There you go. Oh, on reset. Here. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, maybe we have to take it a bit slower in order to 
Make sure we've got our skills up quicker. Let's get that one first. I don't see this doing much healing. Heals allies blessed by you. Let me have a quick look at that. Do we have a bless? Escape. Basic. That's glider stuff, isn't it? Recall. Play instrument. I don't think we have bless. Or does it mean just people that have actually decided to heal? I don't know. Let's get a hit on you first. Uh, get incoming, I can... There we go. That's more like it should be done, I think. It's five and five. Achieve level four. Nice. Let's, can we loot the body? Thank you. And what have we got here? Where's the pollen? It's a leprechaun. Good grief. Why do we have leprechauns? Right, it appears we need to go up there. Collect fine pollen from honeybees. Oh, have I just got to kill the honeybees then? Let's have a look. Yes. Uh, it is indeed. I just have to kill the honeybees. before I kill it. Yes, it will. There we go. Alright, that's complete. But we need to go up this road. Now, there is not a lot of people doing the uh, dwarf starting zone. <laughs> Alright, they're all in different instances. Complete that. Thank you. Okay, uh, we have a speed boost. Thank you. Visiting the mysterious machine. Okay. Hi, can Michaela Inga. Hello. This is great, it's very nice. Okay. New skill set, two skill points. Okay, not 100% certain. I seem to have forgotten. Passive skill can boost 3% of your damage to mana. I can definitely take that then. Yeah? That seems like a good idea, isn't it? All oh, right. Okay. Orosios Songcraft. What's that? Rather than directly engaging in dangerous, messy battles, this skill is designed to offer critical support to those elements. Get their hands dirty. Is this? What's this? This? What is this? 
Increases attack speed. Alright, I really don't know what to do. Oh, what's passive? Convert 7% to receive damage to health. That sounds alright, doesn't it? Transform, Juggernaut. Cancel. Songcraft. Passive. Decreases the cast delay and chance of interruption when hit by minus 50%. Ah, that's alright as well, isn't it? <laughs> uh, okay, I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll, I'll leave that for the moment and let me know in the comments below which ways you think I should go. Oromancy? Or song whatever it was. <laughs> I can't remember. I've only just closed the window. What was it? Songcraft. Okay. Uh, let me know, please, in the comments below. And I will do it in the next episode if we do one. We'll see. Alright, thanks for watching, folks. This is all Grey, signing off.